A little known mammal related to an elephant but as small as a mouse has been rediscovered in Africa after 50 years of obscurity. The last scientific record of the lost species of elephant shrew was in the 1970s, despite local sightings. The creature was found alive and well in Djibouti, a country in the Horn of Africa, during a scientific expedition. Elephant shrews, or sangus, are neither elephants nor shrews, but related to aardvarks, elephants and manatees. They have distinctive trunk-like noses, which they use to feast on insects. There are 20 species of sangus in the world, and the Somali sangji, Elephantulus revoili, is one of the most mysterious, known to science only from 39 individuals collected decades ago and stored in museums. The species was previously known only from Somalia, hence its name. Stephen Heritage, a research scientist at the Duke University Lemur Center in Durham, U.S., and a member of the expedition to the Horn of Africa in 2019, said he was thrilled to put the species back on the radar. He told the BBC, We were really excited and delighted when we opened the first trap that had an elephant shrew in it, a Somali sangji. We did not know which species occurred in Djibouti and when we saw the diagnostic feature of a little tufted tail, we looked at each other and we knew that it was something special. The scientists had heard reports of sightings in Djibouti, and Hossein Rayleigh, a Djiboutian research ecologist and conservationist who joined the trip, believed he had seen the animal before. He said while people living in Djibouti never considered the Sangjus to be lost, the new research brings the Somali Sangji back into the scientific community, which is valued. For Djibouti this is an important story that highlights the great biodiversity of the country and the region and shows that there are opportunities for new science and research here, he said. DNA analysis shows that the Somali Sangji is most closely related to other species from as far away as Morocco and South Africa, placing it in a new genus. The mammal has somehow dispersed across great distances over time, leaving biologists with a new puzzle. The scientists plan to launch another expedition in 2022 to GPS radio tag individual Sangjis to study their behavior and ecology. Kelsey Neem of Global Wildlife Conservation added, Finding that the Somali Sangji exists in the wild is the first step in conservation. Now that we know it survives, scientists and conservationists will be able to ensure it never disappears again. The research is published in the journal Peer J, 